Hey guys, these are the heads that I use and you can really see them in great detail here. You can really see them in the video. They're from Puppets War and they're great. So I'm going to include a little link and um, you guys enjoy it while you're watching the video. 595 pounds, I'm guessing that is. All right. What up players, it's Warboss Tay up in this mud in celebration of the Astra Militarum month of April. We're doing a whole bunch of videos to celebrate the Imperial Guard, or what is now known as the Astra Militarum. And the first video in the series we're going to do is a look at the Puppets War conversion kits for the Soviet astronaut heads. They've got mustaches, they've got little leather helmets, and they will look great in a Australian army as conscripts or uh, anything else you want to use them for. They've got these great bushy mustaches, the leather uh, skull caps can be painted up gray or red if you want to stay true to the Vastroyan theme and they will look really really great. Sell for a little bit over five pounds in Europe and you get five of them in a kit. So the way you would use this would be to combine them with uh, Cadian Stormtrooper bodies would be the easiest and cheapest way to get some nice looking conversions if you don't want to go and buy the metal Vastroyan models. So I put together a Kidian Shock Trooper and I put one of the heads on and here's how it looks. Um, I, th I thought it would look a little bit less glaring but the skull cap on top of the regular uniform fatigues and the armor do look a little bit odd together. Still, I think it's a great product if you want something different. If you want to show conscripts or um, veterans or something, this might be the way to go rather than having the uh, great coat troopers. So I'm going to paint one up and show it alongside a Vastroyan, an actual Vastroyan model. And you can kind of see if you like it or not. But yeah, go ahead and check out the Puppets War, Puppet Wars um, link in the description as well as the annotations and uh, see if this might be something you might be interested in. Conversion kits are great and awesome and I love them and uh, I think they just add to the hobby already. So thanks for watching everybody and we'll see you in the next video.